Load them up, Marquise. Let everybody know the odds. These are the odds of you getting in. The sooner the better. Check them out. Ooh, I have to have these. I really want to get my hands on these beauties. Look at the size of these Asher Cut. The Asher Cut are actually going to be two and a quarter carat in each ear. Ooh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Not only will they twinkle, I mean, it just, again, the way a gemstone is cut allows the light to travel through that gemstone from different directions. The light dispersion. Usually we talk that when it comes to, you know, diamonds, but uh, you can really get quite a bit from this particular cut. Look at the dimensions. Top, bottom, left, right, side to side, every way you look, you have a new type of facet. Seven millimeter. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, one of our shoppers just sent in a, a nice message. They said, Tony and Vanessa love watching the show. <laughs> I love that. My, like by the way, name. my name I is like Jessica. That. That's a Vanessa's nice name. a beautiful name, though. Vanessa. Yeah, it's a beautiful name. It is. It is. But, but what I, is your name? I'm my Jessica. Name is my, my name is Jessica. That's right. Um, she yes. says, <laughs> She says, I love the newly acquired tanzanite I got from Shop LC and now wear it as my wedding ring. I can't seem to stop looking at it. Uh, I've taken the, the word and have gotten a few pieces of Turkosite loose stones to save for family in the future. Thank you again for the education and letting us in uh, on your gem world. That is, unfortunately, we don't have your first name, but it's 360. Look at that. Ooh, she sends us a picture. Tony, you know which one she has? She wears it as her engagement ring. I love this pic. I hope you don't mind us showing it, it, it because it doesn't have your, you know, your face. We'd have to get your signature, your approval if it had your. <laughs> Look at that. She got the round cut, Tony. You and I did that as a special oh, the other day. Shoot us your that first is name. A very, very, very good gemstone. Yes, that's one, that was one of my favorites this year. That's a beauty. And it looks good. It does. It looks amazing. And it looks really good on you. Mm-hmm. And engagement, see, that's what I'm talking about. Wedding rings, engagement rings, anniversary bands. Can I, I, can I say something? Good night, of course. We have a friend of ours. His name is Luke. Luke is a producer in the UK where we have a sister channel. Oh. Two years ago, Luke approached me when I was in the UK and he said, Tony, I am getting engaged and I want a gemstone that you think is going to be a good price, you think is going to value in the future and that you like. I said, uh, Luke, I'm going to recommend for you two stones. We didn't have indicolite at the time. So I'm going to say, look, either get a rubellite or get a turkosite. He got his wife as an engagement ring, a turkosite from our company. So what I did was I actually cut for him the matching pendant and the matching gemstones for the earrings and gave them as a wedding gift. That's how much I believe in this gemstone, ladies and gentlemen. It, he is a friend of the company. He works with the company for over 15 years. He said what I thought he should buy for his wedding. And I said a turkosite. I don't think it gets more relevant than this on a gemstone that I believe so much. And then I cut the gemstone so he could make her the pendant and make her the pair of earrings. And he sent the picture. And it's an absolute, they're an absolutely amazing, amazing team together. But I recommend it to my friend, a friend of ours, a friend of the company, an employee of the company for a wedding. I said, you want to buy? Is she the woman of your life? Is she special? Don't give her something everybody has. Give her something nobody has. And he gave her a turkosite. That's how much I believe in this gemstone. All right, ladies and gentlemen, only three left. <laughs> oh my goodness.
too good. That is too good. RJ, RJ saying I'm in. You, you sold RJ on it as you were talking. He was like, you know, my, my wife does deserve something that most people don't have. She does, and he, he buys, you know, things like that as often as possible. These happen to be that, you know, that pair of earrings, even if you've seen, listen, few and far. Far and few. I never know which one is first. Few and far or far and few. So I always say both. <laughs> and I get text messages in the show when people correct me. One of these days I'll get it. But the bottom line is if you've seen Turkicite studs, they're not going to be Asher cut. Most of the time, too, at this kind of price point, we're talking one carat. If we can have them in stock. I mean, it's just not the usual. Today, Gosh, four and a half carats, two and a quarter carat in each ear. You all saw the size. Oh.